never stays a day A bad luck's always a coming my way For today's adventure, we're doing something a little bit strange, a little bit terrifying. Today, we're at a place called Halloween Depot. They have a pop-up market, and they have a special guest, David Howard Thornton, who played Art the Clown from the movie Terrifier. We're going to meet him. We're going to talk to him and get his autograph. Add it to the Wall of Horrors in the Grim Life Collective. Oh yeah. So you look absolutely phenomenal up there. And you come with sounds. <laughs> oh man, was this a like trick or treat? Oh man, I love it. Hello again. <laughs> All right, it's, it's about time. <laughs> so this one here is what, 40, right? Okay. Are you sure? Okay. Oh, All right. That's like, oh, <laughs> awesome. Oh, um, if you may, our YouTube, do, we have everything signed out to us. That's us right there. So Grim Life Collective, just one word? One word, oh, okay. however you'd like to write it. Oh, okay. And I thank you. It's funny, you go to a lot of conventions and everybody gets like stills from movies and a lot of times the eight by tens or the photos that you get yeah. aren't really the greatest quality. These are some of the most clearest, beautiful photos I've oh, seen. Right yeah, yeah I mean, it's it's perfect. So yeah, Damien, much respect. I, I think it's also because you know, we've shot in HD and stuff like that. So you can, you can Makes old sense. Old. Yeah, yeah. Old ones, you know, they, it's not all in HD. It's just an old right. look to them. But Damien did a great job there. Huh. This still, we want no, you can that keep that. it. Yeah, by all means. Oh, we're doing a photo. Okay. Oh, yeah, perfect. Oh, I'm geeking out a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Got to put the bunny ears on you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Stay spooky, my friend. You do, man. I'll see you around, all right? No problem. <laughs> she scares the crap Right? Out every, time. every time. Every <laughs> time. I'm about to mess my pants over here. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. See you all later. You're scaring everybody. You're absolutely scaring everybody. And we, and we love it. <laughs> Right? Welcome to Halloween Depot here in Los Angeles, California. Actually, I think we're a little south of that, yes. Los Angeles. But we're here at Halloween Depot. They have these different pop-ups and they invite certain horror celebrities into town to mingle with horror fans like Jessica and I here at the Grim Life Collective. Right now I'm talking with David Howard Thornton who played Art the Clown in the movie Terrifier and the upcoming Terrifier 2. Yes. Terrifying movies. Well, thank you, thank you. We do our best. And you know what? Standing next to you without no makeup on, mm -hmm. I can still see Art the Clown. And I'm, <laughs> I'm over here shaking a little bit. It was a very twisted movie. Oh, thanks. We do our best. I, I must have done my job if this has, if my own face does that to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't mean it that but way. But that's why I'm still single anyway, so maybe that. <laughs> oh, no. Like, th this could possibly change it. Yeah, you never who know. Who knows? Who knows? So, with Terrifier being so terrifying, mm -hmm. I actually have one question that I want to ask you. Now, Jessica and I, we travel all over the country visiting real-life horror locations and filming locations, right? Pretty We've cool. seen some pretty crazy, terrifying real-life stuff. Yeah. When it comes to horror movies, not much terrifies me. Okay. Watching Terrifier, I squirmed. I, I cringed. There was one particular scene, which if you saw the movie, I'm not going to talk about it, but if you saw the movie, 
You know what I'm talking about. It People was, are split on that scene. Yes, yes, yeah. very, very, <laughs> right down the middle. Yeah, right down, right the, down middle. the middle. With that being said, while you were working on Terrifier, mm -hmm. is there, was, was there any part of the movie where you were sitting there in costume and you went, okay, I'm doing this. Like, you know what I mean? Like, was there like a, a moment where you looked at it and goes, I can't believe I'm actually doing this in character. You know what I mean? Yeah, um, I think it was, a <laughs> it was, it was a little bit of a surreal night is when I was, um, strangely enough, doing the, I call it the Buffalo Bill scene. Okay. Where I, I'm wearing the skin suit and yeah. everything like that because it was my, my first night working really with a Samantha Scafidi who played Victoria in the film. And so that's like, I'm, I'm actually doing this. <laughs> and they're like, well, I'm actually doing this. <laughs> it's the yeah. same so it was really weird. It was a very weird sensation because you know, I look down, I have boobs on. <laughs> and I'm like, I have a degree in elementary education, and now I'm doing this. I'm actually doing this. <laughs> It's, it's all about life experiences. Yeah. You know what I mean? Whether they're good or they're bad, it's just a story. And yeah. I was just wondering about that, you know, what moment on set yeah. kind of caught you off guard like that. That, that was definitely one of them. So it also, it was just seeing myself for just the first time in the full makeup and everything. I can't just, imagine. That was, <laughs> that was pretty surreal, too. I scared myself going to the bathroom that night, too, because I yeah. forgot I had it on. I'm like, oh. God, that's just me. <laughs> they do say that a lot of times whenever people who are acting um, and they put on the makeup for the first time mm -hmm. that and they see it, then all of a sudden the character comes to life. Yeah. You know what I mean? So even when you're not in makeup and you're at home and you're looking at yourself in the mirror, do you ever look at yourself that way like Arthur Clown and just be like, Sometimes, up, buddy? <laughs> sometimes I do the little smile or something like that just, just for shits and giggles, you know? Very cool. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was nice talking to you, Yeah, man. very nice, nice meeting you. you. Nice meeting you as well. There's a vendor here named Lei Boni by Beatrice, and she makes these Disney-esque ears, and I'm really digging these horror ones. Look, there's Frankenweenie back there, Michael Myers. Oh, man, this is really cool. And Jessica, you found some that you want. All right. Yeah, those are 100% Grim Life Collective approved right there. I'm loving those things. Oh, wow. And you look beautiful in them. They're... I think I should try on the Michael Myers, though. Well, I don't know, but this, this green is your color. Those are cute, too. I can see you with the Halloween ones. I don't know, which one are you feeling more? I think you need them both. Never stays a day. A bad luck's always a coming away. 